At NASA's Langley Research Center in Newport News, Virginia, aeronautical researchers use one of the world's most advanced flight simulation laboratories to design and test aircraft, space vehicles, and sophisticated space structures. They test their designs with complex simulations that must be run at frame rates so high that only a real-time supercomputer can handle the speeds and data involved. R&D flight simulators are just one example of the growing number of real-time activities that need the performance and speed of supercomputers. Researchers developing products like automobile suspension systems, helicopters, and spacecraft need a combination of real-time computing and supercomputing to help cut costs, shorten time to production, and reduce risks. The high-speed data transfers required for high-definition television and satellite data processing systems also depend on a level of performance that only real-time supercomputers can provide. Until recently, real-time supercomputers were not commercially available. Now, Convex Computer Corporation is changing the world of high-performance real-time computing with the introduction of the world's first fully integrated real-time supercomputers, the Convex Preemptor Series. The Preemptor Series combines gallium arsenide and bi-CMOS technology with real-time hardware and software features to provide affordable real-time supercomputing. The Preemptor series comprises two families of systems, the 5500 family and the 5300 family. The Preemptor 5500 real-time supercomputer family features from one to eight CPUs and a performance range from 50 to 800 megaflops. It's designed for rapid response real-time applications that demand the highest processing speeds, throughput, and flexibility for future growth. The Preemptor 5300 real-time supercomputer family with one or two CPUs and performance ranging from 50 to 200 megaflops is packaged in a footprint small enough for the tightest facility requirements. It's ideal for deployed systems and for applications with modest expansion requirements. Researchers at the Langley Research Center chose a convex supercomputer to drive the R&D flight simulator because of its scalar performance, compatibility with other systems, fast response rates, and central server capabilities for distributed flight simulations. Today, NASA researchers are using a convex real-time supercomputer to model multiple flight sequences, advanced space structures, and radar simulations. And the convex supercomputer is helping these researchers keep pace with the future. It can rapidly reconfigure and run several simulation programs simultaneously, perform different simulation studies day after day, and support new program development. NASA Langley has one of the most sophisticated simulation facilities in the world. Uh, since the convex system has been installed, we have been able to increase the fidelity of the models that we simulate. We have been able to increase the number of aircraft that we simulate at one time, and we've also been able to increase the flight regime. That is to say, we've been able to go from very slow speed flight to very high speed flight within the same research simulation program. Support from Convex has been excellent. Uh, this has been a team effort between Convex and NASA to develop a real-time simulation product. This product will be extremely useful to both government and industry. The convex supercomputer that drives the flight simulator at Langley Research Center is the world's first real-time supercomputer. It can respond to external events in a matter of microseconds. And it computes complex equations of motion at speeds that range from 30 times a second to as high as 1,000 times a second. Supercomputing speeds and performance alone are not enough for high-performance real-time applications. When pilots change a control position in a flight simulator, like the one at NASA Langley, the simulator must do much more than change the out-the-window scenery and cockpit instruments. It must reproduce the exact avionics involved. It has to take into account electronic warfare features, 
and simulate the reactions of other planes. Simulator's been a very efficient tool in that we can do lots of repetitions of a particular kind of task. And what the researcher wants to know is, are the changes that he's made to a particular configuration going to be reflected in how well we can do the task? And because we can do as many as uh, 10 or 12 or maybe even 15 runs in an hour, he gets lots of data and it makes his analysis job easier. Convex designed critical real-time hardware features into the preemptor series for robust and versatile real-time performance. In addition, the Convex RTS real-time software provides a dual-purpose, multitasking environment. It simultaneously supports software development and real-time tasks. Since it schedules and runs both real-time applications and a Unix-based development environment, time-sharing applications and development programs never interfere with real-time program execution. With the Preemptor series, we have added hardware and software features to allow applications to be run in real-time on supercomputers. Convex was actually encouraged by its customers to enter the real-time market. We have a dedicated group of real-time specialists in both hardware and software to develop products that are unique to the real-time market. By combining the proven power of supercomputers with real-time features, we're able to provide our customers with products that meet their high-performance computing needs in unique real-time environments. Over the past few months, we've had the opportunity to go out and talk to many real-time organizations. It gives us a great deal of satisfaction for them to tell us that they can do things with this product that they have never been able to do before. Now with the Preemptor series, Convex Computer Corporation continues to lead the way, setting new standards for real-time applications with the first commercially available and affordable real-time supercomputers in the industry.